the fact that many people in the country are still considering insurance companies as companies that are established with the name of stealing people's money, some insurance companies in the country have opposed it, saying insurance companies do pay if someone has got a genuine accident or problem. Dogo Singi, the marketing manager of UAP Insurance, said that sometimes they get challenges where some people come with unfinished claim forms and some of them do not even want to follow the procedures, which sometimes hinders them from being paid. First of all, insurance. If you have a genuine accident or a genuine case and you use the proper procedures because the problem is sometimes people bring in unfinished claim forms they have uh, you know you know they don't put proper information in their claims uh, processing forms it becomes also a challenge like any other uh, sector we are regulated by IRA and every claim that we pay out a proper procedure must be followed Singhi also said that last year UAP Insurance paid 24 billion shillings in terms of claim which they wouldn't have spent if they were not paying their clients. He added that it's true there might be some ghost companies within them that are just focusing on making money only. Given to the day-to-day to the -day people, is first of all, insurance pays. Get me? It pays. Number two, we are also, uh, like UAP, we paid 24 billion. We paid 24 billion uh, in terms of uh, claims last year, compared to about 34 uh, billion that we put in terms of claims request. You know, like claims have actually occurred and they are upset. So we do pay out a lot of money. Google Singhi say that people should embrace investing in insurance because if they are not insured, they will put their life at risk, especially when they get accidents. He added that when anyone gets an accident or problem with their businesses, they are usually at a very bad financial loss. Every day, the mere fact you're, you're, you're not insured, you're putting yourself at risk. And when that risk occurs, you'll be at a very bad financial loss. If, if you take up insurance, it's protecting you in the event uh, an accident or uh, you know, unforeseen event uh, occurs. This comes at a time when so many people do still fear to put their money in insurance companies. This story was compiled by Francis Samla for Record News.